right, and then a little bit of recap. Today was Circuit Python Day. Uh, we do this every year. This is a there wasn't a, a holiday in August, so we made one up um, for our team. So this is a paid day off for our team at Adafruit, and it's also a worldwide celebration of all the things going on in the world of Circuit Python. So today, um, if you want to catch up on what videos there are. Um, we kicked it off in the morning. It was Circuit Python Day introduction with John Park. There was a special 3D Hangouts with Pedro, Noe, and Liz. Um, they did favorite projects, uh, and then Liz talked about some coding and some 3D printing. We did beeps and boops with Synth.io, a Circuit Python Day panel discussion hosted by Paul. Um, this had, I think, Todd Vaughn and some other folks. It was really neat. There was the Circuit Python Day game jam with Foamy Guy. Tim, there was the Matrix Portal message board with Maker Melissa. There was a Circuit Python Day chat with Jeff and Patney. Then there was a special edition of JP's workshop. There was a deep dive with Scott. We just did the show and tell, and now we're doing Ask an Engineer. So there's a bunch going on um, with Circuit Python, and this is a pretty good way to get a recap. We're also doing this every single like Circuit Circuit Python Day is kind of every week. We have our community meeting every Monday. We have all the videos that we do throughout the week. So there's a lot. Um, we also have our newsletter uh, and put together the latest one. This one, of course, we were talking about Circuit Python Day, but there's a bunch of stuff in addition to um, what we were doing. Uh, if you want to see a neat interview with Noe and Liz, you can check that out on Hackster. Um, there's a neat handheld uh, Linux device. Uh, you can probably run Python on that. And then uh, Hackaday has a couple of neat things. And then this was uh, PyScript. I didn't know Intel was involved with this. Did you know that? Oh, I didn't, but that's neat. That makes sense, right? That's so if you want to run and toll is it? Yeah. So if you want buffin. Yeah. So if you want to buffin it. if you want to run Python native in your browser, um, you can check this out. There's a uh talk Python um video chat and more, which is really neat. Um I think that will probably eventually all work together in some way, like running Python in the browser, talking to Python on hardware, Python, 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 Python. Um, so check out the newsletter. This is our weekly celebration of all things. Python from MicroPython to Python on Linux to CircuitPython to even some other, sometimes we toss in other um, like scripting languages for microcontrollers because we'd like to keep an eye on that. Um, but this is where you can see the latest library updates and more all in the newsletter delivered to you every single week. Data for Daily is a site that we do. We do that because it's not connected to your store account in any way. It's a completely separate site, which means we don't spam you. We hate going to a website and buying stuff, and then you get spam forever. So we wanted to make Lame. it super duper clear. Your store account is not connected to the newsletters. So, um, you know, yeah. that's how we do it.